In this tutorial, we'll see how to add and modify physical size info in 3D maps. Physical size works by setting a DPI value, which, together with the map's pixel width and height, is able to store real world physical size. DPI means dots per inch. The dots in our case are pixels, so it actually means pixels per inch. For example, suppose you have a map with 1024 by 1024 pixels, like the one we're about to create in the new map window. So we've set the pixel size to 1024 by 1024. If we now uh, enable physical size info by clicking this switch, and if we set the DPI to 1024 also, we are saying that this 1024 pixels should have a real world size of an inch or 2.5 centimeters. So by setting the DPI information, we can define a real world physical size. Since physical size depends on DPI information, it only works with image file formats that can store it. And this means PNGs, TIFF, JPEG or BMP formats. You'll see sizes displayed in centimeters or inches, and this can be changed in the preferences window. So if we create this map, we've just now created a 1024 by 1024 pixel map, and we've set the DPI information to 1024, which means it will fit an inch. The width, the real world width will be an inch, and the real world height will be an inch also. So by changing this DPI value, or if necessary and possible, the pixel width and height, you can define the physical size info of the map. Let's open a fabric and see how we can set this information on an existing map. In this case, we don't have any physical size information here. Only the pixel size is listed to, to set it. We can go to the transform tool and we also have here the same controls that we've seen in the new maps window. If we enable the physical size info switch, we can now set the DPI. We know that this sample has an height of 12 centimeters and that's about 400 DPI. So I'll be setting this to 400 and it's displaying 30 centimeters, so it's a bit more DPIs. Okay, and so at 435 DPI we have a width and an height of 12. This is how we can add physical size uh, information to our maps.